I just grew up loving biology. It was for me about learning more about God. It was interesting to learn more about how he created humans and how interesting everything works. I wanted to be a surgeon and I thought it's gonna be super fun to just be on in like magazines or something like for some surgeries I would perform. Yeah, I got accepted into med school, but everything changed for me when the war started. The, of Ukraine, the, sound of missile strikes the news and coming sirens. in just as we come on the air tonight, Ukraine's president addressing what the US people US of this country. described just as the most significant ago. military it's action in neighbor in on multiple fronts. People are not safe in their Russian own troops homes. are moving in on the capital, closing in on Kyiv. I saw a lot of people struggling and the, the things that I saw was like, it was awful. Gospel-wise, Ukraine was pretty cold when the war started, but then when everything broke out, people were gasping for tracts, Bibles, and everywhere we would go, people wanted to hear about Jesus. Kind of put new price tag to lives out there because I saw people who really, they, they didn't need any medical help, they just needed Jesus. That just reassured me, again, that the most important thing you can do is be in the ministry. My dad, he's American sent missionary to Ukraine. We all are Ukrainians. And when the war started, we kind of shifted the ministry a little bit to refugees. Men from 18 to 60 were not allowed to leave the country. So my dad and brother, they stayed back. Me, my mom, my older sister, and my younger brother, we came here months after the war started. A lot of supporting churches helped us and let us stay in their missionary houses. When I heard about the college, I started getting into and I Googled it, obviously, and Google Maps. I was trying to look at the campus because I was nervous, obviously. And then I heard some sermons from Pastor Chapel, and I just fell in love with the place. Transformatively within you and within me. The manifestation of God so that people see Jesus in you. When I made a decision to come to West Coast, I, w I was pretty content and I was sure that I want to be here. I started off with one year Bible. Again, in Ukraine, we don't really have a lot of Bible colleges. It's not really developed. So I didn't know about any programs that were here. So I just thought I'm gonna play it by ear. I switched to visual arts. So I'm taking one of the photography classes. It's amazing, like it's class. I'm learning something new because I know nothing about camera and how to navigate it. Maybe I'm just a second semester freshman talking, but I, I hope this like time never ends in college. I love this year. The big goal that I'm setting for myself is develop that in Ukraine, because again, it's very bad there and missionaries need help of people who are ready to start media ministries and churches. If we don't tell a story about our church, there will be some kind of story. So it's up to us to tell the story. So I really want to translate the right message. And I think this major is amazing to teach how to speak and how to translate the right story and be a good storyteller. My name is Sofia Kazachenka. I'm second semester freshman and I'm doing visual arts with minor in counseling.